Storm slam North Texas. Tornado warning. Bringing heavy rain. You see that hail bouncing? Hail and even flooding a local hospital. But even with several tornado warnings, no apparent touchdown anywhere in North Texas. But now we brace for a monster change by morning. Not too far away. Hi, everybody. Doug Dunbar. Most of North Texas able to avoid any significant damage, thankfully, from the storms this evening. They rolled in fast. They move out of the area almost as quickly, but not everyone avoided the worst of it. Andrea Lucia will start us off tonight. She is in Irving to bring us up to date from there. Andrea. Yeah, Irving firefighters say they had a real close call back here on 635. They were telling me straight line winds blew through here. And you can see some of the damage left behind by those winds right here next to me. There are several branches here, like this one here along MacArthur, that were taken out by the winds. But take a look at what happened to the UPS truck I was just talking about. We have video of it rolled over onto its side. Now, thankfully, no one, including the driver of that truck, was injured. But firefighters say winds blew the hood up as he was driving down 635, obscuring his view. That driver, they told me, has more than 30 years of experience driving these rigs, and they say he handled the situation perfectly. He was able to move into the far right lane before that truck rolled, preventing it from hitting any other vehicle or even obstructing the interstate. He said the wind got him, started rocking his trailer. Uh, he almost saved it, and then a second gust ended up blowing him all over. We're just fortunate that no civilians or other vehicles were involved. And yeah, those firefighters say the trailer was empty at the time, making it more susceptible to high winds. They've been hunkered down, ready to respond to calls for help, but say that that is the most serious one that they have had so far. Now, out here, we have seen, again, some of, the, some of these trees down. Uh, we've seen signs down. We've seen uh, some loose bricks and a little bit, just a little bit of flooding here uh, on the sidewalk. This was actually deeper than I suspected, and it just goes to show you, you don't know how deep some of the flooding is until you get into it, but just a little bit of that on the streets. Unfortunately, that is uh, about what we're seeing out here. Reporting live in Irving, Andrea Lucia, CBS 11 News.